So after updating to Windows 11, I regretfully realized that I wasn't able to get to my, I uh, wasn't able to use Internet Explorer, so I can't get to my old um, DVR web portal to see all of my security camera feed. So I have a, so this is what I have. I have this old model of a DVR system where cameras uh, feed plugs into the back and then this system hosts uh, kind of that management information. Um, so to get to it though, I, I was I was relying on Internet Explorer because there's this web plugin that just doesn't seem to work with any of the other uh, browsers. So, uh, but I did figure it out, um, and these are these are the simple steps to to make it work. But there's a slight catch. So you may have tried this and may have failed on you. I'll, I'll show you how to actually make it work, but. Uh, essentially, all you really need to do is enable Internet, Internet Explorer mode in your browser and then in, uh, in Edge and go ahead and install that web plugin. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, so really, let, here, let me just hit the download button since I'm here. Um, go ahead and open up the executable. I am installing the web plugin. So you'll, you'll think after doing that, you should be able to just refresh and get there, but no. Uh, well, maybe it's the URL, remove the additional context, but nope, takes you right back here. And that, that's kind of where, what leads to the frustration. So what you really need to do is reload the page in Internet Explorer mode and one thing you might try is this option here to reload in Internet, Internet Explorer mode so go ahead and click that and it's running Internet Explorer mode asking if I want to get out of it but you would think that this will work refresh still doesn't work get rid of the context Oops. yeah Get rid of that context there and still doesn't work so it's not working because the wrong thing is loading in internet internet explorer mode so you have this page the web plugin download page running in internet explorer mode but what you really want is just that ip address that's going to take you to the dvr portal so the way you do that is you have to go into your settings go to default browser and then just add that IP address there so that it won't redirect you as long as that page can run in IE mode. So add that entry there, uh, go ahead and open up a new browser or a new tab, navigate to the page and I'm in. So I can log in to my system and see all of my camera feed. So hopefully the same uh, workaround works for you.